The weather and holiday meant a boost in visitors to San Francisco. Both tourists and locals from the East Bay were looking for a cooler place to enjoy the 4th of July weekend. Dahlin has more on just how much tourism is starting to heat up again. Cool weather in the scorching hot East Bay typically means 70s to 80s in San Francisco. In fact, we found a lot of folks wearing jackets in the evening along the waterfront. Just being from Phoenix, I, I appreciate even this weather. Many businesses say the nice weather brought in a lot of visitors. The weather did help us a lot. Um, a lot of our customers this last uh, couple days, they were from the Central Valley, Sacramento, uh, Southern California, and they were all just trying to get out of the heat. And, uh, and a lot of our a lot of our locals as well. You guys can yep. hop on this one here. Manit Soha right, runs San Francisco Deluxe Sightseeing Tours, the hop on hop off buses. The holiday fun on a Thursday this year uh, definitely helped out. The tourists ended up staying for, you know, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. He says while his business isn't back to pre pandemic 2019 levels, this year has been better than the last couple of years. We're seeing an uptick in the tourism. Uh, June was June was a little bit better. And then July has uh, been off to a really good start. Many bars and restaurants say they noticed the stronger start to the summer season as well. If you're a good place and you have good product and you have good people working for you and stuff, it's going to be fine. San Francisco travel experts say while domestic tourists and European visitors have come back to the city, they're still missing a big chunk of the Asian market. They say only about 50% of the Chinese tourists have returned. And traditionally, Chinese visitors spend big money in San Francisco. The Chinese tourists we're not seeing very much of. Um, it's, it's been that way for about uh, four years now. But with a little help from the nice weather and the city's image slowly improving, Manit is optimistic. We're really hopeful that uh, we'll have a good, strong summer and uh, continue uh, this upward trend here that we're seeing. San Francisco travel experts predict the number of Chinese visitors will return to pre-pandemic levels by 2026. So not quite back to normal yet. Still a couple of more years to go.